Hi there, Chris from Moto Legends, Chap in the Cap, here today to talk to you about a boot from a, an Italian maker called Forma, and the boot is called the Hyper. This is it. We're recording this in late November 2019, and we've just had two new colorways of this boot arrive in this morning. Um, the blue version has been around for a while, but today we've received grey and we've seen brown, so these are brand new in. I saw this boot at a show some while ago. We haven't historically done former, but it's the way we do business. We don't buy into ranges. We find products we like. So we were on a former stand at a show. We found, I think, three or four styles that we really liked. Some of our customers had told us how much they liked former boots. So we pulled a capsule collection out of a former and this is one of the boots. I was very keen on it because of the color. I thought there aren't many blue boots on the market. I could see them working really well with jeans. Everybody in the company disagreed with me. It said I was mad and said, who on earth is gonna buy a blue motorcycle boot? Um, it's been our biggest selling trainer boot all year long. So fantastic boot, really comfortable. I love the color. Unfortunately, it would seem that not many other people did because Forma have now withdrawn that boot from the market. So no longer do we have a blue boot. I managed to snaffle a pair for myself before that happened, but this one no longer. But what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna talk you through the features of the boot because it's gonna be available obviously ongoing in brown and this gray color. So these are the Forma Hyper Boots. There are lots of similar looking boots on the market. And in recent years, there's been an explosion in what I suppose you would call the trainer style motorcycle boot. Now, they're not for everybody. The reality is, and I'm sure most people who buy those boots understand, you're making a trade-off in terms of safety. When you buy a boot that looks like a basketball boot or a trainer boot, you're not going to get the levels of protection that you get in a Caterpillar or Timberland style uh, tough riding boot. They're going to be more comfortable to wear, they're going to be easier for wearing all day, you're going to get certain levels of protection, but there is clearly a trade-off. What I like about these boots is that they are somewhere in between a traditional trainer. They're nice and soft. I think you could wear these all day. They are very comfortable to wear, but you've got a bit greater height. I think they're a bit more rigid and a bit more protective than most of those shorter trainer boots. So I think it sits somewhere in that between the two. So let's just go through the boot. I'll talk you through some of the main features. As you'd expect, you've got a hardened toe here. So a nice hard toe there. You've got a protector in the ankle. You've got ankle protectors on both sides, padded with memory foam, so you don't feel those. Same in the tongue, you've got memory foam there. So this really is a lovely, comfortable boot to wear. You've got a waterproof membrane, so it's a waterproof boot. What you always have to remember with any short boot is that a short boot is not gonna be as waterproof as a taller boot. That's nothing to do with the membrane or the laces or the zip. It's to do with the fact that it's shorter. So as you're riding along, your feet are on the pegs. It's pouring with rain. The rain is hitting the ground, bouncing off the ground. If you're wearing a shorter boot, there's a greater chance that water's gonna come up and fall into the boot therefore making your foot wet. The other thing is, depending on the pant you're wearing, if the bottom edge of the pant is getting wet, then as that water kind of dries or falls down, it can fall into the boot. That's quite common with a motorcycle trouser because often the waterproof membrane will end a good three or four inches above the hem. So the bottom part of many motorcycle trousers has no waterproofing, and they figure you don't need that because you've got a boot on, but what that means is that that material gets soaking wet, so water can fall into a short boot. Again, this is gonna be better than some short trainer boots because it's a little bit taller. Um, you get a zip with a gusset here. Now, that's a wider gusset that I've seen on some boots, but when people see a boot with a zip, they think, that's great, I can just get in and out on the zip. In truth, you can't with with most of these boots. What it means is that when you undo them to get into them, you probably have to undo them less far. Um, but that, so that makes it easier to get in, but I think rarely is there gonna be a scenario where you can really just put your foot in that day in, day out, and never use the laces. A tough rubber sole, non-slip, um, oil resistant, a 
shank, it'll be a plastic shank so you don't get a metal shank in a boot like, like this, but there's still rigidity in that sole if you end up having something um, putting pressure on that, that is not going to crush your foot. So that's the former Hyper boot. We just think they look fantastic. I think they're a little bit more protective than your av average um, trainer boot. They look really cool. They are really comfortable. Everybody who puts on a pair of these says that they are um, fantastic to wear. We think that the price, £170, as we record this towards the end of November in 2019, is a pretty good price. Don't think you can go wrong or wrong with these. Um, shame that they don't do the blue anymore because I love that colour, but we've got them in this brown. We've got them in the grey. They're in stock now. So if you'd like more information about the former Hyper Boots, then you can visit the website www.motolegends.com. If you would like to receive our email bulletins on future new releases, then you can do that on the website, on the front page of the website. Our front page has lots of little squares. We call them tiles. There's one there for subscribing. It's nice and easy, very quick to do. So if you do that, you'll find out about all new products as they're released. And here at Moto Legends, we have products arriving pretty much every day of the week during the season. So that's the best way of keeping up to date with what's going on in the motorcycle apparel world. If, however, you prefer to receive your information videographically, we would love it if you were subscribed to our YouTube channel. And you can do that on the button below here. Again, that's nice and easy and quick. If you are so impressed with these Hyper Boots and the wonderful review that I've given them, then you can buy a pair immediately. If you go to the button uh, top right of the page and click on there, that will take you to the former Hyper page. Uh, you can read more about the boots there and you can buy them there. So thank you very much for listening to this. This has been Chris at Moto Legends. We'll talk again soon.